what is going on guys and welcome back to another episode of the portland bulls madden 24 franchise in this episode we are going to be taking on the one and two tennessee titans uh their team overall is better than ours and in the sim week we did pick up a 21 to 14 win over the jacksonville jaguars taking a look at contracts coming up um just right off the bat Jalen Thompson and Trey McBride are two key players coming off contract, so we'll have to do whatever we can to re-sign those guys. Cameron Thomas also coming off contract. DJ Humphreys and Shaquille Griffin as well. Um, I think DJ Humphreys, we're fine without him. Uh, Shaquille Griffin, the same. We could probably find a younger guy to replace him. And then at the end of the year, Paris Johnson Jr., um, we will have his fifth year option available to pick up did offer uh, Jalen Thompson a three-year contract and he did go ahead and decide to re-sign with the team and then we offered Trey McBride a five-year deal and he also re-signed then we offered Cameron Thomas a contract and he also decided to re-sign a look at Jay Stevens he did get his hidden development uh, revealed and he is a superstar X Factor. So what I'm gonna do is change his ability to. Hmm, I want to go Trez because of the read options we run. Um, but like something like Dots would be great because his accuracy isn't the best. Uh, so what I. Oof. I think I'm just going to go Trez for right now, um, and, you know, we don't have to worry about him fumbling at all. And then, Patreon Matt Hill is also pretty close, we should see him revealed at the end of this game. So we are at home, starting off this game, uh, in a weird turn of events. The Titans have Sam Darnold as their quarterback, uh, and Derrick Henry's still there as he's running rampage on our defense there didn't take a huge look at their team um i do see someone their center was uh hit with that bugged draft class so there is still people in that draft class bugged out thankfully we don't have to uh worry about sam Darnold scrambling too too much never mind gonna have to put up a quarterback bye Sam Darnold completes his first pass right there. They do have Elijah Moore. Um, D-Hop's not here, it looks like, but they do have Traylon Burke still. Speak of the devil. Oh, we break up the pass, though. Okay. He was wide open. Yeah, this wide receiver core, I don't know how good they are, but we'll have to keep an eye on it as they could make Sam Darnold look really good here today. Kind of uh, backing away from the Derrick Henry treatment. So they're going more pass here. Gonna bring some pressure here on second and five. As he gets the ball out pretty quick. Is that a Conquo? I think it is. Got Cleveland Farrell there on a spy, but they're going to Derrick Henry and he uh, dives in for a touchdown. He was untouched though. We're gonna try a big shot here on first down. Play action bomb. It's Marquise Brown's open possession catch. He still holds on through the contact. And big 33-yard play here to open up the game. Gonna get the ground game going here today with Leon Ware. He uh, gets about nine there, I think. Brock Bowers underneath, wide open. Can't make anything happen after the catch, though. All right. This uh, fade here to Marquise Brown might be a good chance to get a touchdown here. So we uh, tried it, but Caleb Farley air played good coverage. We go five wide here, see if we can get something open. We can't. Jeffrey Simmons chasing us down. Tried to make him juke, but couldn't do anything. Third and three here. Oh, I did not realize that was a read option. Uh, I thought we were just going to Leon Ware. Back out on defense after taking our three. Oh, Moody had a pick. He doesn't have the hands for it, though. I'm gonna 
shift the line left here for a Derrick Henry run. It's not a Derrick Henry run, though. Uh, they're going to a tight end over there in the flats. We hit him for a loss. Big third and long here. Got to play some stellar coverage. So over the middle's open, and we break it up with Isaiah Simmons, thankfully. We almost had a pick, but he was almost uh, able to snag that, too. Let's see what we can get going here on a second and ten. We have Hollywood Brown, but he drops the pass. Third and long. Alright, we're mainly going to be looking for Brock Bowers out of his cut. Uh, but he's not really open. It did open up Hollywood Brown underneath, though. Able to uh, hold on through the contact. Maybe we can get Leon Ware going here on this run play. Blocks are developing. Juke move. Broke one tackle. Gets brought down pretty quick, though. Let's see if... Yeah, we're gonna... We're actually going to audible out of that. I'm going to say if we can see if Jay can recreate his running attack from last week, but... Oh, thank goodness he held on through that. Oh, he freaking tackles. Okay. Big play from Hollywood Brown. Uh, after a somewhat inaccurate throw. Thought we were about to throw a pick. First and goal, and they ain't ever going to see this one coming. The quarterback draw... Oh, okay. I thought Hernandez would go and block that linebacker, but he decided not to. Let's see if we can maybe get a pass play. We got McBride over here on the crosser, but he's going to get tackled short. We got one more shot potentially here at the end zone, and that handoff took forever. Had to take three there. Um, <clears throat> just wanted the points. So they are going to go back to Derrick Henry here. We're able to get that second effort tackle there from Isaiah Simmons. Going to the pass. Thought we had it locked up. We're probably about to get called for P.I. on that, even though we barely touched him. Yeah, okay. It was actually illegal contact, not P.I., but still not really what you want to see. Is they're going to test Callaway deep there? We break it up though, thankfully. Bringing up Blitz here on second down. Griffin, almost there. Can't bring him down with Isaiah Simmons, but we do bring him down with Tyler Rapp going at the knees. Third and long here. Uh, try to play lights out coverage. I get caught up on my own dude. He gets that cheeky spin break tackle too. I knew what would be open, I just couldn't get there because I ran into my own dude. Not what you want to see, I just got pancaked. Derrick Henry's got eight yards there. Derrick Henry's tired, they go uh, RPO, we miss a breakup and then a tackle. And I think that's probably a rookie, Edward Jennings, untouched for a touchdown. All right, we have 2.30 and three timeouts to work with. Definitely a lot of time uh, to try to go down and score before half. But plays like that aren't going to be cutting it. We have to be better. Um, they are? Okay, two minutes. gonna make a play happen with Jay's legs here. Great block from Hollywood Brown. We're just gonna run out of bounds. Just like that, we flip uh, to the other side of the field. Tried to kind of get him to jump there with that hard count. Trey McBride breaks a tackle and holds on, thankfully. I do like Hollywood Brown uh, up the sideline over there. If we can have enough time to throw it. They're playing good zone, so just take the sure thing and Morris underneath. Switch it up to a run here. And fullback didn't block who I wanted them to. We got plenty of time though. Trying to move with a little bit more urgency as we're getting hit as we throw. Um, but I don't want time to run out on us. Time shouldn't be an issue though with three timeouts. I just don't want to 
be too relaxed and it bite me in the butt. There's a penalty flag. It's holding, isn't it? Yeah, of course it is. We're gonna try it again, but to the other side. Oh, man. Ooh, Mega Man missed. There we go, Lynn Turner. Still gets the first down regardless. Let's see, 19 seconds. Go Bowers here underneath. Stiff arms and runs out of bounds. Still positive yards though. Step up in the pocket with Jay and he just trots in untouched. And uh, there is another rushing touchdown to his resume thus far. He honestly could be leading the NFL in rushing touchdowns after last week and uh, now this week too. Who knows? Alright, I assume they're gonna run out the clock here and just go to half. Yeah, seems about right. We're just gonna let them. We don't have uh, timeouts or anything to get the ball back, so. Going into half, down one. Uh, it's been pretty back and forth thus far. Their defense holding strong in the red zone. Oh my god, go Lynn Turner! Oh my goodness, he's gonna do it! Another kick return! It's his second one all time! What a way to come out in the second half, though. Just scored immediately. And coach wants to us to go for two, so if they do score, they can just tie it up. Jay breaks a tackle, uh, but just throws it into the dirt. I tried to throw it to Brock Bowers, but uh, his icon wasn't available because he was uh, blocking someone for some reason. They're going to go back to Derrick Henry, Quantrez Knight with the solo tackle. Uh, hopefully this team can feed off the energy of that kick return touchdown. Try to plug up that hole in case they go back to Derrick Henry. They are going to pass it. Underneath is open though. We are having a tough time tackling him, but Aconquo goes down with an injury. He's not heading back to the locker room, though, so he should be okay. They're definitely going right here on the left side. Oh, I got pulled into a block. But we're able to take Derrick Henry out of the knees. Ooh, quick flats to Traylon Burks. Man, they are breaking a lot of tackles this game. Sucks. We almost got illegal enough, or illegal contact again, though. We ran right into him. Right, our pass defense hasn't been looking so great. We're going to send some pressure. Maybe man coverage is the best, but we're in the backfield with Isaiah Simmons for a sack. Second and 19. We're going to bring another blitz, see if we can come through with back-to-back -back sacks. Nope, we're going to get hit with a touchdown. Okay. Elijah Moore, wide open. Gonna go for two. Oh, Derek White got beat. That sucks. Leon Ware getting the carry here. Still not able to get going, though. He definitely does not have that uh, James Conner explosion type plays that I uh, am kind of used to from him, but Joseph Morris getting a nice catch in traffic and then breaking the tackle. Gonna try a read option here. They do bite on uh, Leon Ware. Get brought down from behind though. Jay can't break a tackle. And Coach wants to try it again, so why not? Uh, they're gonna bite on the quarterback though and no run blocks holding up on that play. Third and three, we're gonna see if a uh, play action pass can maybe catch him. So we got uh, McBride in the flats, and he gets the first down. Another play action pass. McBride's wide open. Oh, what a way to come back to the ball for that catch. That inaccurate throw I thought was gonna be uh, upset 
it's upsetting because he was wide open. Flipped uh, McBride over there, caused them to shift a little bit, freed up some room for uh, Leon Ware there. I don't play Alien Games 4 though. Let's see if we can catch them here. Nope. Maybe Hodgins. Okay, he's able to hold on to that. Makes it third and short. Alright, I'm gonna put my trust in my offensive line here. Go to Leon Ware. We do get the run blocks at least for a first down. Might be getting pressed here. Yeah, but not good enough. We're just gonna slide down with Jay. He didn't get a good enough uh, break on that press coverage. Let's see who's open. Nobody. Okay. And uh, Leon Ware does not pick up that blitzer for some reason. Starting off the fourth quarter and a third and goal. We really want a touchdown here. Settling for three doesn't really help us. And Jay's just going to trot in for another touchdown. He is... Good. He has like five rushing touchdowns in the past two weeks. Alright, we got to play some lights out defense here in the fourth. Um, or else we're going to let Tennessee get back into this game. I think Ben don't break here works um, as long as we don't give up a touchdown. We can be okay. We have a touchdown here. And thankfully we have them in a third and five. I'm going to put on a quarterback spy though. Don't want that cheeky scramble. But he finds a Conquo once again for a first. You can see them going back to Derrick Henry here. They are... And I get pancaked again. But Tyler Rapp makes a tackle. Definitely going past here in this five wide set. I'm gonna keep an eye on a Conquo. But it's Traylon Burks. Thankfully, Shaquem Griffin wraps him up fairly quick. Evan definitely see a pass play here. Putting on a quarterback spy so we don't get any uh, cheeky scrambles. But Traylon Burks over the middle. That was my zone, but like also I was covering the Aconquo just like sit down flat and really had to choose my boys in there. As Derrick Henry is now a pass catcher. We're gonna hop on Matt for this play, see what we can do, if anything. He's getting double teamed though. Thompson gets thrown off by a Aconquo and uh, they're getting a first down. Their tight end's gonna have a hundred on us, most likely by the end of this game. He's their number one receiver this game this far, by far. But uh, we're able to shut down Derrick Henry for back to Henry once again. And he's breaking so many tackles there, oh my goodness. He broke like four tackles that play. And that drive took four and a half minutes. Uh, so they drained a lot of time off this clock. And uh, we kind of need to do the same, but in like three minutes. Oh no, I did not like that at all. Blocks deteriorated so fast. All right, we're in a very bad third and long situation. Hollywood Brown, get us out of it, please. Oh, he couldn't get there in time. He beat Caleb Farley, too. Alright, this could possibly be it for the game. But thankfully, Brock Bowers has our back. We get the first down. That could have been so bad. Out of the two-minute warning, we have uh, Hodgins being pressed over there. And oh my goodness, that was... Alright, whoever was over there can... Uh press really well apparently. We're gonna go Morris underneath. Just take what we can get. A third and three situation here is not the greatest. We'll have to uh, just take what we can get. Oh my goodness, I thought Farley would run with whoever he had pressed, but I guess not. And once again, we are just in a bad fourth down situation. We do have all three of our timeouts, but you never want to use them. But thankfully we get the first down. 
Bucks is uh, not good on the old heart right here. Too many fourth down situations. I don't like it. We're just going to step up here. Clear lane to run. We'll call a timeout here. Really uh, tough to use a timeout there, but I think it worked out for the best there because uh, Leon Ware getting some great run blocking and was able to run out of bounds. And we're inside the 20 here with only 47 seconds left. And with two timeouts still left, I'm going to run another run play here. Lynn Turner, oh my gosh, he's got blocks. Oh, I should have gave myself some time, but we trot in for a touchdown, the go-ahead touchdown here. Late in this game, 42 seconds left. Lynn Turner, for sure the MVP of this game. The kick return touchdown, and now this late go-ahead score. All right, we have to be very careful here. They do need a touchdown, but they have 42 seconds and three timeouts to work with. So they certainly can get this done if they want to. But we're off to a good start. We just have to make sure nothing really gets past us deep. As long as we play everything that's in front of us, we should be okay. I say that and we could get tackles broken just like that though. They did burn two timeouts on uh, not big plays, to be quite honest, as now they're going to have to go hurry up. No, they used their last time out. They're flipping their formation. <clears throat> Interested to see what they go with here. They really have to play the sticks. They're the sidelines, not sticks, but they do. There with the Conquo. Or no, that's Jennings. Oh no, I'm stuck on a lineman. Stuck on a lineman. Not good, not good, not good, not good, not good. Keep running. Okay, he throws it away. Thank goodness. 14 seconds left. We have to play this very smart. I got a Conquo. He has to roll out. He has to throw it away. There we go. Seven seconds left. Gonna be playing this three-man deep right here. I don't think uh, Derrick Henry's gonna be a problem, so we're just gonna switch over to all these guys here. Sam Darnold's on up, then um, there we go. Two seconds left. Ooh. All right, we just have to hold on here, and we win. We know where they're going, and we break it up. There we go. That's game. We end up winning 29-33 in a super close game uh, with the Tennessee Titans down to the very final play, but we're able to squeak out a win. And taking a look at the stats today... Uh, Jay Stevens passing the ball, 17 for 23, 198 yards, 73% completion rating, but no touchdowns. Uh, very little passing touchdowns out of Jay. The same cannot be said for his rushing touchdowns, though. Nine attempts, 77 yards, two touchdowns. And for a quarterback having five rushing touchdowns in the past two weeks, Leon Ware had the most touches today, though, with 10 attempts for 54 yards. And then Lynn Turner had two carries for 25 yards and the ever so important last second touch. Well, not last second, but uh, that go ahead touchdown there with 42 seconds left in the game. On the passing side of things, a lot of people got involved today. Trey McBride, four receptions for 45 yards. Marquise Brown is still holding up as Jay's favorite target, four receptions for 75 yards. Brock Bowers having three receptions for 29 yards and an important fourth down conversion. Joseph Morris, three receptions for 32 yards. Lynn Turner, two catches for 14 yards. And Isaiah Hodgins only having one reception for four yards today. And on the defensive side of things today, Isaiah Simmons and Shaquille Griffin are our tackle leaders with seven. Uh, Isaiah Simmons, greet, er, Isaiah Simmons, Garrett Wilson, and Taylor Rapp all having TFLs. Uh, Rapp and Williams having one, Simmons having two. And then Isaiah Simmons having the only sack on the day with one and no interceptions today. And just to check for you guys, uh, Jay is in fact the touchdown leader in the NFL for rushing. So, is he a running back? Is he a quarterback? I, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> he might just be the next Lamar Jackson. 
but he is he is fifth in passing yards as well he just doesn't have the touchdowns to show for it he has more interceptions as he does touchdowns so we really do need to work on fixing that all right guys that's gonna do it for this episode tune in next time when we take on the t houston texans uh in houston um but guys don't forget to like and subscribe hit that bell for post notifications uh hopefully you guys are still enjoying the series i am uh still enjoying making these videos for you guys but without further ado i'm andrew from sexton gaming and i'm out peace